in these final days. <laughs> mm, that's true. I wish be a better mantis. Be a better person than I was. Yeah, that's not hard, lady. That is not hard. I mean, seriously, I, I realize you're out doing good, fighting crime, etc. but... And I'm not even going to say worst mother ever, but definitely competing for pretty damn disappointing as mothers go. You know, getting son killed. However... Can we take that ship? Okay. There's a set of stairs over there. There was a back room here. There's also an elevator out. Some weapon. Okay, this is this is where the mantis lived. This. Okay, seriously, have I got myself a lair now? Do Dorian's computer? Do. Wait. Hmm, that's not bad actually on the blister. Have we got ourselves a lair? Do we have a lair? I feel like... Okay. Is, is, is that the mantis suit? Sentinel's mantis spacesuit. Incendiary Mantis Pack and Incendiary Space Helm. It's it's very white. I, I mean, I also wish to be prepared for any situation, but there are practical limits. No. No. I get it. I get it. I get. It, I, get it. I just. I got. I got. I got. I gotta say. I gotta. I gotta know. I guy have to know. I have to know. It's, it's just, it's, it's, it's something I, I need to. Yeah, I'm thinking no. Original Aquila City Charter. <gasps> okay, that's for the museum. Yes. All right, we should definitely deliver that. We're kind of passing there anyway. On the way to the den, we are going to the den. I promise. We are definitely going to the den. She's really got a fairly well sorted uh, lair here. Security computer. Security log. Okay. Explosions detected. Mainframe failing. Security offline. Archived security. Okay. D. Vol Volklane, unassigned, admin role, Mantis. Guest, D. Volklane, exit. Okay, deleted log. Process scorched earth interrupted. Can I get access to this? Can I get... Can I become the Mantis? Except a Mantis without the suit. You know, because I don't want to look... Monumentally silly. Starship lift controls. Oh, oh, no, no. Come back down. Come back down. Come back down. Come back down. Down. No. Down. Down. Oh, no. No, I sent it up. I sent it up. I, I sent it up. I didn't want to send it up. I want to get. No. Oh, okay. Come down. Just. Just. Down. Please come back down. What? No. No. I. No. 
Oh, okay, did I just... Oh, God. Okay, right, I'm supposed to land on it. And then, oh, God, we've got to get up. we got to get up. we got to get up before someone else steals the ship. I didn't look inside here. Let's just make sure I haven't missed anything. You know what? Who cares? I've just sent a ship up there. Let's go and make sure that ship doesn't get nabbed by any spaces we didn't... Oh, God, really? I'm carrying too much? I cannot be carrying too much. Of course, I can never be carrying too much. We're all carrying too bloody much. What have I got that's... I don't want to... <laughs> okay, hopefully this will take us all the way up and we can exit out very, very quickly. Got it, got it. Open door, open door, open door, open door, open door. Open door, opening door, done, done. I'm going to leave this building and see the ship flying off with some spacer leaning out the window going, ha, ha, aren't I? That's what's going to happen here. That is what's going to happen. And I'm going to follow that person to the ends of the universe. Uh, where would it have been? Where it'll, it'll be... Up, 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 up. There's a ladder, there's a ladder, there's a ladder, there's a ladder, there is a ladder. There it is! This is... Not razor leaf, that's a plant. This has got to have a cool name. I mean, there's... No oh, it's a it's rear entrance. Insert rude joke. Oh my god, I think this is ours. I think this is ours. I think this is ours. No, it is. It's actually called it's actually called the razor leaf. Huh? Okay. Okay, let's see what we've got here. We've got uh, Oh, this is Captain's Quarter type thing. I think it's Tayo. I may be wrong. Alright. Captain's locker currently empty. Okay, cargo holder's got some stuff in it. Let's see what we have. Do I have to register this? Do we need to take this back? We probably need to take this back. We almost certainly need to... Okay, just before we do, I want to know what the ship is. I want to know what the ship is. Oh. Okay. Come on, be good, be good. No, that's the heavy hopper. Razor leaf. Reactor A? Are you kidding me? Reactor A? Crew 2? Wow. This was the Mantis's ship. I mean, I guess they were going for style rather than, well, anything. I've got to take it, though, right? I've got to take it. it we, we have to have it. We can't leave it behind. It's not a thing. That is not a thing. And we're getting out of here, right? We can fly this back home and store it. Yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Okay, we got an armory. An armory and... You know what? I was thinking of having a layout just like this. I really was. Have an armory and then have the, uh, the boarding point right here. Seemed like a sensible thing. However. All right, then. All right, I'm going to take off. And then we'll have to meet the guys back. We're going to the den next. We are going to the den next. Okay. All right, you know what we need to do? We need to make this the home ship. And unfortunately, we're going to have to tell... One of them to go back with the ship. Who are we going to send back? I'm thinking... I like... You know what? This is a tiny ship. We'll just take Barrett and Vasco, yeah? All right, let's... Okay. Where? Razor Leaf. Let's do... Oh, wait a minute. How much cargo does this... This cargo is only 420? This is only 420? No. No. They can go back in this ship. We will take off in this without the crew. Oh, no, wait. Will we lose everything that's in the cargo? In the, in, we, we, we're going to lose everything that's in the cargo if we... We got a lot of stuff in the cargo, so the question becomes, do we really 
How far? Okay, let's just go see the hopper. Let's go see the hopper. Okay. I've got all the cargo from the ship. Uh, Sam's going to take the main ship back. We're going to take this to the nearest star yard and get it registered because, I mean, I've got to keep this. I can't not keep this. It has to be done. All right, then. So, let's fly this back to probably the den, actually. We've got to go there. Oh, I was going to go to Aquila, wasn't I? Do we have to go to Aquila? All right, you know what? Let's just... First... Oh. It is very red. <laughs> okay. Here... Oh, God. What happens if we get attacked in space? All right, let's just double check. I am carrying way too much. The heavy hopper has... That's the razor leaf. Um, the heavy heart part has currently got a car. No cargo. All right. Do I have anything in the captain safe? I don't think I do. You know what? Too late now. Let's see what this baby can do. Okay, there's Barrett. Okay. And... Oh. Oh, did we leave Vasco? Is Vasco taking the... Oh, okay, never mind. That's fine. It's got a lot of it. Let's just... Quick. Quick. How agile is it? Hard to know. Right. You know what? No messing around. We got what we came for from this place. I am not doing any looking around. We... Wait. We can't even get to... We can't even get to Cayenne. We can't even get to Cayenne. We can't... Oh, oh you're kidding me. Oh, you're actually kidding... Oh, no. Why am I hearing the words it was at this moment that he knew resonating around my skull right now? Right. Later. Okay, so that's everyone. Hey, good to see you. Carrying as much as possible, including myself, without being overloaded. The cargo is completely full, but the important thing is we're all able to move if we need to. <sighs> okay, yep. Definitely need to get the power sorted for the I want as much on the engine as possible and yeah, I don't think putting power in the grav drive is going to help. I think there is just a limit to how far this ship will go. <sighs> we need to find civilization. And by civilization, I mean a place with a spaceport. But pretty much everywhere on the map forces me to go through Parima first. So I guess we've got pretty much no choice but to jump there. We go to Red Mile. <laughs> Wait a minute. Someone mentioned this. It's some sort of... Well, I got the feeling it was some sort of competition or race. Someone said running the Red Mile. All right. Vola is where Neon is. There is a spaceport there. But maybe there's a spaceport at Parima. If there is something there... Well, I gotta go there anyway. So, let's see and let's hope there is civilization. And by civilization, I mean a place that can change ships. Oh. Okay, what? All right, that's bounty hunters? Wait, they're not shooting me. Do we have bounty defenders? For once, I really want... Okay, I am not seeing any... Bounty defenders. I don't want to die! The mantis ain't real! Oh, they think I'm the mantis! I think we've got defenders... Oh, I'm shooting a bloody asteroid, and I'm... Crashing! Okay, 
I think I've got defenders. Yeah, we do. We have. Okay, you know what? While they're shooting each other, just, just. Oh, what the? Oh my god! Yeah, right. The particle beam weapons on this are not that good, and that's. Um. Okay, let's just take out the weapons. Yes. And yes. Oh, grab drive. He's got it. Got it. We we don't have power on the grab drive anyway. We. Okay. This. One more left. We got one more. We got one more. We could do this. We could do this. We could do this. This ship's quite... Okay. Oh, okay. Can we dock? Should we... Oh, he's taking us out. Let's... I think we should probably... Yes, let's dock. And let's hope the bounty defenders don't... decide to shoot us. Thinking with a mantis. Okay. Seals are good. Air pressure good. And we're docked. Okay, brilliant. Let's just... Corners or hiding spots. They know this ship better than we do. Yeah, yeah. All right. Okay, so... Mm, maybe? Yeah, I'm... You know what? Let's go... Let's go big, shall we? Let's go big, and... All right. Oh, God, harvested organs. Right. There they are. And... Let's get rid of their weapons, and... Mm. Okay, wow. All right, these guys are pretty tough. Actually... Yeah. Bloody ecliptics. All right, okay. Well, they're not shooting at us. Should we take this ship? I think we need to take the Mantis back. You know what? I don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk losing the Mantis. Let's just see what we're dealing with. Category C. Does that mean it's a Class C? It says it on the seat, but this doesn't feel like a Class... Okay, no, that's complete crap. Although it does jump a little further than the Mantis, but no, that's kind of garbage. We're going to leap... <sighs> Okay, I'm going to stand up. Oh. Yeah, it's going to be one of those days, I'm afraid. I am going to stand up. And we can loot the place and then get back to our ship and just... Let's hope the bounty defenders don't want to talk. Because honestly, I don't really fancy picking a fight with them. But every time I speak to them, they just annoy me so much. There does seem to be one bounty defender still alive, but he doesn't want to talk to me, which is nice. Okay, this thing's pretty fast, and the mobility seems pretty good. What if we boost? Let's... Oh, you know what? There is a big difference with these A-class engines, and the, the ship does feel very mobile. It's just really doesn't have any... Well, it has very little shields and so little firepower. So, and so little power. You know what? Maybe I should take this. I... I mean, I'm still saving up for a variety of things. But right now, I think the extra power is probably useful. Okay. I need to destroy five ships to unlock the next. Okay. Yeah, well, I'm sure that's going to happen. Alright, we've well, got a little bit more power. It's not much, but every little helps. I guess. Okay, right. Well, I'm alive and I need to check this place out. Okay. Red Mile. That... That looks vaguely civilized. Am I seeing anything else? What is that? Parima 2C. Doesn't that symbol mean there are... Okay, what well, if I got... What, what does it say? Go. Go to... Go to... Paradiso! 
Okay, so that is a luxury resort or something, isn't it? And it's got... It's got someone defending it. That's almost certainly going to be civilized. But you know what? Whilst we're here, let's just scan these moons. And then I say we check out this red mile before we move on. Okay, where is it? It's over there. Yeah, that's... You know what? I want to check it out while I'm here anyway. Sight is clear. Descent started. Okay. Well... There's a landing pad. Which is... Yeah, it doesn't look that busy though, does it? Uh, it's a little... Hey, Captain. Need help with anything? <sighs> yeah, getting the ship back. Okay. Doesn't look too hostile. But it looks a little basic here, doesn't it? Alright, let's just go it's and... Be on the boat. <laughs> yeah, let's just go and... Okay, what... Oh, yeah, no, it's rear, rear, rear exit. Please hold the jokes. Mile is not a challenge, but I have seen much, much worse. Okay. Don't really know much about this red... Is there some... Fighting going on over there? Ow. All right, it's extremely cold. Two G. All right, it is, it is cold, and uh, I feel very heavy. All right, that's not very pleasant. Okay, what do we have? Hit. Don't think the staff or the rangers will help you if you get into trouble out here. Okay. You'll be talking to the underside of my boot if you keep trying to strike up a conversation. I'm not really trying to strike. Okay. Control console. Are they. Oh. Oh. Okay. Do you have. Well. Anything remotely useful? Okay, you know what? It's all a bit more legal now, I suppose, but hardly more civilized. It's some sort of competition, but it's a fairly extreme and dangerous one, right? Okay. Yeah. I don't have high hopes. I mean, there was no ship technician, and this place doesn't exactly exude... Wait, me. I didn't do anything wrong! Okay. Bullshit. You didn't think we'd notice that you tried to slip away without paying your check? Oh, there's a sign for ship services. I was just going out for some fresh air. I, I even told the bartender. You can ask her yourself. Fresh air, huh? On a planet with no atmosphere. That's enough, stalker. It's a good point, though. Lower your weapon. We don't shoot guests over a misunderstanding. Sir, please return to your table. It's bad practice to leave our establishment without paying your bill first. If you need some fresh air, pay up, go outside, and come back in and start a new check when you're ready. I'm sorry, but I didn't think it would be a problem. You were wrong. Dead wrong. <laughs> That's enough. I think the gentleman understands. Now let's all go back inside, shall we? And Stalker, you and I are going to talk about this later. I can't wait. Okay, interesting. I'm in charge of security here, so I'm the last person you want to piss off. Oh, I, I've got a long list of people I've annoyed and... Well, frankly, you're nowhere near last. Like, not even close. Sorry. Hey, watch out. You cause trouble, and I will not hesitate to end you in any number of ways I see fit. This ain't the United you Colonies mean try. cupcake. Here, cupcake? You to me. I lead the security force. <sighs> wow, are you annoying? What is with... Yeah, what is with all the security here? Why are you all so hostile? Because we have to deal with the dregs of society, like you. 
because May lets us handle things our way. Best way to keep people in line is through fear. After you see your first head split open on the bar floor, you're gonna think twice about skipping out on your tab. Maybe you don't start that fight. I'm gonna think lost twice bet. before coming here in now. the first place. I mean, you run some sort of private security force. Call it whatever you want. We're ecliptic mercenaries. Eclip so I think twice about pissing us mm. off. Or else you may find yourself with nowhere to hide. Oh, too late on that. I'm afraid. I've already annoyed plenty of you and usually killed them in the process. Why would a mercenary force like Ecliptic take on a job like this? Money, right? What do you think, moron? Money. May pays us well to keep the assholes out. I make sure my people pretty much get the run of the place. Free booze, free entertainment, you name it. And if anyone's got a problem with it, well, we've got ways of making people disappear. Oh, God, you are such a try-hard. Like, seriously. Go bother someone else now. Monumentally and... Oh, no, no. I, I think I'm going to stand here and bother you. Hi. Nice armor, by the way. Very shiny. Stay in line, and we will Okay, no, you know what? Ship services. I... Is you believe that? Like I'm gonna run off without pay. The hell kind of scum do they think I am? I would not ask that question. Do you know where the person who runs ship service? Okay. Hello, please. Need something for your ship? Yes, a replacement. Hey, you're the captain of that ship. Yes. Is your registration paperwork in order? Uh. Who's asking? Who's asking? The starport master of Red Mile is who? Think that'd be obvious, given what I just asked you. Okay. Uh, I, of course, I, th I think, yeah, yeah. Of course. Fine. Truth is, I don't really give a damn. I gotta ask, because it's my job, you know? Okay, that's a relief. And don't get me wrong. I used to care about running a tight operation. Had everything going nice and smooth. But when May started building this place up and hired those mercs, well, everything went straight to hell. I voiced my displeasure, and now I'm on the outs. Oh. Okay. What mercenaries are we talking about? May's security. Yeah. Bunch of wannabe soldier assholes is more like it. Call themselves ecliptic. They think there's some sort of uh, elite paramilitary unit. Oh, I like this guy. I'll tell you what they really are. They're nothing but punks with guns that get off on pushing people around. Yep. I get the need for having some security out here. We're independent. That ain't lost on me. But these guys are the worst of the worst. More trouble than they're worth, you know? Oh, I know. And not by a little. So I'm with you. I'm totally with you. May's the one in charge here. Yep. She took over a little while ago. Drove out all the regulars because they didn't fit in with her new vision for the place. Now, I'm not saying they were saints, but at least there was some respect for the people whose blood and sweat makes this place work, you know? You'll find her inside. Whatever you're here for, she's probably the one you want to talk to first. No, 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 she's not. You, you are the man I want to talk to first. Sounds like this place went through a lot of changes. Sure has. May, she's got these big ideas about making this place some kind of must-see attraction for the whole settled systems. You'd think she'd care a little bit more about the quality of the damn starport. Anyway, I'm sure you're already sick of my bitching. If you need parts no, for not at all. or a top-up on the grab drive fuel, that's me. I just... All of the above, but more importantly, can I bring my ship okay. here? Okay, take a look. Okay, there's the ra okay, the razor leaf. It's an odd mismatch, isn't it? It's a, it's a little strange, but I don't hate it. I can update the reactor to well, something quite a bit better. It's still only going to be an A class though, so not that much power. So I'll never really be able to get the same sort of firepower that I can get on the C class. Or the shields, for that matter. Oh, I could get a better 
I could definitely get a better grav drive, which would let us jump further, but I don't need it, because I am switching ships. It is... The, the engines are all... There's a lot of engines that require power. That only requires two power. It's A class. And it's got two... Those require three power. Why do those require three, but the bigger ones require two? That is odd. Do you really need all of those? We've got mobility of 100. All right, and a max speed of 150. Does it really need that many? That doesn't seem... Okay, what? What happens if we remove... Okay, that's just as mobile, just as fast, and the jump range has increased, and it needs less power. So what were those engines doing other than just adding weight? Scanjammer. A scan jammer that increases your chance of evasion during a ship scan by 10% if you're using a shielded cargo module and carrying contraband. And then just better versions of it. Okay. Interesting, but not really something I need. Okay. That has a grab jump thrust of 38. My current jump range is 21 light years. This would allow me to go what? All right, that's got a... Jump thrust of 27, so if we remove this and replace it, we get 29 light years. That, that is actually a big improvement. Okay, that looks, kind of looks like ears or something. It looks a little odd. Doesn't look very aerodynamic. Not that that's important in space, but I don't like it. I know that isn't really important, but what about backwards? Okay, that... That looks better, and it will be able to shoot things behind me, which is probably more important, but... Very little coverage of uh, the sides, if there's something at the sides. If I put them at the sides and stick them out, how does it look, and will it... cover, like... things... Oh, good God, no. Uh, that's... no. That's sort of... Yeah, I do not like that. It's just... What about on the roof? Let's have a... Uh, it's... Well, it's better than on the rear, but I still... I'm not feeling it. I, I think we'll just, for now, we'll have it pointing backwards and see if that helps. I cannot tell you how relieved I am to have the ship back. I'm not ashamed to admit it, but I was feeling almost naked without it. Yes. The captain of a ship is pretty much naked without his ship. And I'm not saying that Mantis ship wasn't a good ship for what it was, but... After... Flying around in this thing, basically it sort of... Well, it felt like the equivalent of running around in a thong bikini or something. Which I realise is a pretty awful image. Okay, before we leave, let's just go and check this Red Mile out and see if they've got traders we can sell some stuff to. Although, God knows why anyone comes here. I mean, why would you want to come here? Apparently there's some event or something going on here, but really? The security just talk to everyone like they're absolute... Like that! I mean, what sort of tourist brochure have they got? Come to the Red Mile! Be abused, threatened, and looked down upon. You'll have an absolutely great time. You still in... Bit of shock. All uh, right, then. Thank you. You have no idea how happy you made me feel. I didn't check what sort of ships you're selling, did I, actually? Hey, yeah. how you doing? All the actions in the casino. You probably want to be in there. Yeah, I'm going to go and check it out. I am going to check it out. I notice you don't have a trade authority kiosk, so let me see what ships yeah, you've got for you sale, though. Me what you want. I'm just browsing at the moment. Okay, that's... Alright. 
am I wrong for having the first thought of wanting to sing I like big butts when I saw it just it just there's something okay yeah probably I am very wrong okay you know what I don't hate that what was this one called the trader rail star the slipstream too I don't hate that at all I'm liking Oh, I'm taking some ideas here. I am taking some ideas here. I mean, it's crap. It's expensive crap. It's got pretty good particle weapons, I suppose. The Autobahn. <laughs> okay. I don't like it, but I don't hate it. C-Class. Oh my god, it's a tortoise. The Space Ox. It's got character. The carry or <laughs> Who came up with these names? I mean, granted, it's a good description. Cargo capacity. Not exactly imaginative names. So this is how you're supposed to have your turrets. Pointing sideways. Just don't like it. The raptor to Something a little reptilian about that, isn't there? Yeah. Weird mix of engines as well. The Mantis had that. Vindicator! Which looks like a Stroud Eklund lunchbox that's trying to, I don't know, stick its arms out and look tough. Okay. Ah. The Caravan 2. Okay, now that bothers me. This, the ho it's not symmetrical, which it doesn't have to be. Some of the greatest ships in history were not symmetrical. But this does not look like one of the greatest ships in history. Honestly, it kind of looks like someone was trying to build a spaceship that looks like a bed. Okay, well, that was an experience. Yeah. Bye. Thank you. Um... That looks like the long sword, doesn't it? Hello. It starts of trouble. Give me an excuse to air you out. I'm in charge of security here, so I'm the last person you want to piss off. Okay, now I want to talk to the owner of this establishment and just ask why? What the hell were you thinking? Are you mad? Have you considered the reason the place isn't that busy is the people you hire hey, suck? just so you know, I don't water down the drinks like our last bartender. Okay, well, that's good to know. Hi, welcome to Red Mile. We've got clean rooms and neat drinks. Can I help you out with either of those? Or both? Ooh, what about both? Okay. Honestly, a room doesn't sound like the worst thing ever. I'd like to get a drink. What other services does Red Mile offer? Aside from the restaurant and hotel services, we offer full service starship maintenance and refueling. Just speak to our starport master, Lon Anderson. And don't mind him. He may be a lazy old fart, but when push comes to shove, he gets the job done. Oh no, he's my new favourite person. He is my new favourite person. For he, he got me my ship back and he helped me upgrade it. We got a better engine. So he, he's okay in my books. Yeah, he's a bit cranky. But honestly, I don't know if you've noticed, that's a bit of a thing here. All right, what's the wildest thing you've seen in the Red Mile? Oh, I saw this guy get full on eaten by one of the larger creatures we had out there one time. Just swallowed him up whole in one go. Clearly he was a goner. Not five minutes later, after the bets were called and everyone was settling up, the guy bursts out of the thing's stomach and goes on to finish the course. You can imagine that was an interesting night. Just don't imagine what that guy smelled like after this. Okay, I went through a bit of a roller coaster there because my initial thought was, wow, you're a psychopath. You sounded genuinely excited about a guy getting eaten. But then it turned out you were excited about the... Okay. Let's go. I've got other patrons to serve. You really don't. It's not that busy. Okay, you know what? How much is the room? We do have a room available and ready to go. We can book up to a week or you can go with the daily rate. What'll it be? I don't think I'm going to be here for a week. So let's just go with one 
I've never been here before, and yet I get the feeling I've said this somewhere else. Right, yes, one day. Okay, I'm giving you the room at the end of the hall. It's got the best view of the Red Mile Run. The Red Mile Run? What is the Red Mile Run? What? <clears throat> end of the hall. Hi. Uh, end of, end of, end of the... You didn't happen to put that in my list of... No. It, end of the hall? Could you could you give me a clue? Is it is it here? I just like him intensely. Donovan Reese. Donovan Reese. Why does that sound familiar? Isn't that a reporter? <laughs> you wouldn't last a minute in the Red Mile. Of course, I probably wouldn't either. Okay. What is the Red Mile? I've got a good view of the Red Mile from... Oh, for God's sake. Could it be... Oh, these look like rooms. Is this my room? This is my room, and it's got a good view of the Red Mile. Is... Is that the Red Mile? This is not my room, I realise, but does it have a better... The Red... Okay, it does! It's got a view of the... What the hell is the Red Mile? What the hell is the... Okay. Slight change of subject. What the actual happened here? Thank you.